Hey guys, happy homebrew Wednesday. It's Larimer 22 and I'm still in Georgia and uh, not much going on the homebrew front because I'm not home. So, uh, but I did make it down to a microbrew place down in Orange Park, Florida. Uh, it's called uh, Brewer, Brewer's Pizza and it's in Orange Park. It's located about 45 minutes away from me right now. So it was a nice little haul down there. Uh, they have a little microbrew place, and the brewery is the brewer's name is a uh, Pinglehead. So uh, what I'm going to show you now is they've got nice labels. See Pinglehead, the Pinglehead Red, and we're going to drink it. It's an Imperial Red, and it is 7.8 percent. And uh, they poured it like right out of the tap into the bottle. It's kind of weird with the way they did it, but. That was one of the ways I could get, get their beer. Not a bad beer. You see it? It's pretty good. So you can smell the hops in it. it smells really good. This is a really good one. I had this one there. And I also had a peanut butter porter. It was called uh, Miss Lovin. So that was pretty good too. So not much going on here. Uh, I got some clips of me going down to the uh, pizza place. So that that will be on at the end of the at the end of the homebrew Wednesday. Uh, also this week I tried a uh, uh, Anthony Rapino. Uh, a brew that he sent me, uh, beer mail, and it was the speckled heifer cream ale. It was, uh, I think it was about maybe four and a half, five percent, and it was nice and light. It was pretty crisp and clean, nice and clear, and everything. Uh, I did a review for him and I sent it to him, uh, I PM'd it to him, and uh, I did a lot better on that review than I did the previous one. So, uh, uh, everything else is, uh, Pretty much, I'm down here for maybe two more weeks. I don't know. I hope I'm not going to be here that long, but two more weeks, and I'm home for Thanksgiving. I hope. So, uh, one of the things that uh, I got at the the pizza joint was a nice uh, looking pizza, and I know Puka NC they did a uh, a uh, video on their pizza that they made one night. So it looks pretty close to yours, Brad. So I uh, hope hope it uh, does it justice. So. Uh, the beers, uh, I didn't include the the website for it. Maybe I'll put that in the comments if I if I get time to do it. So uh, it's in uh, it's right outside of Jacksonville. It's in called Orange Park, and uh, it's excellent food, excellent beer, and a good selection. So uh, that's about it for Homebrew Wednesday, and I will uh, see you guys next week. Enjoy. Hey everybody, it's Larry Mo 22 and this is where we're going to go today. I'm in Georgia right now, but this is down in Orange Park, uh, Florida. So let's see what kind of beers they have on tap. Bell's Two Hearted. Was it Bold City? Cigar City? Dogfish? Greenwood? Green Room? Laganitas? Lazy Magnolia? I'm again. Pinglehead, I think that's their brewery that they have right there at the little brew pub. It's got black IPA, it looks like a porter, Indian pale ale. They got some big beers there. Uh, right there, that one's the one that's interesting to me right there. Miss Lovin. It's a peanut butter porter. There's a pumpkin ale. And I think they got Rogue. Saint Somewhere, Southern Tier, there's Stone 16th Anniversary, I just saw Man Bear Pig, he just did a uh, review on that, and Weyerbacher and Victory, so totally excited about this, and I'll talk to you later. Okay, we're here. We're here. Jason's my driver, he's my hey. designated driver. He's scared. He offered, so I took him up on it. 
Brewers Pizza. Here's the beers they got on tap. Great selection. Jason got the black hops. I don't know if you can see anything. Yeah. Pretty dark. And I got... No, you can't see anything. <laughs> and I got the... Miss Lovin. This is the peanut butter one. And voila, the pizza appears. Hey Brad, looks pretty good. Looks kind of like yours. I forgot to show this to you. It's kind of a freaky ass uh, coaster, but if you're afraid of clowns, you might not want to go there. <laughs> Later guys.